Welcome to University of Chimera Stadium in steamy Tombstone, Arizona, where the only thing hotter than the heat is the ceaseless sinning. The players are ready to rock the red zone and red light district tonight. Let's go down to the field for kickoff. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Motor City Maniacs battle. The Cardinal Sins. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs. Mutants, I'd like to fuck. He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you halfwit. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team. On a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all? Oh, oh, va, 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 boom. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First down and three. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Stanford team doesn't translate quite as well in normal gravity, but he's doing his best. Better than you could do. Your dancing is like a death rattle of an overdose meth addict. I uh, owe you an apology, Bricks. It does hurt when Junior's mean. Well, let's start a support group, Grim. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Oh. Totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he runs it for four yards. <laughs> Second down and six. Oh, and did he just put on a display? Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes.
mistakes here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. First and ten. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. If you don't hear it coming, it'll get into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? That kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. Second down and ten. And that's a pick. And now the quarterback is cursing How with the brain scrambler. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Graham. Second down, the side. defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down in a lot. Any 
he finds open space, he's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch! Well, little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. Second down and five. Steps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Third down and five. <laughs> well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Let's see if they can get a... He's got the ball now, and he's going to try and score. Oh, that worm grabbed him by the head and didn't let go. And the worm's got to the bathroom, man. Why did it just crap out, you think? Well, you're just talking a lot of crap right now. Boom! First and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. No one was interested in that incomplete pass. Man, not a ball's feelings are hurt. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? Third down and ten. You know, this berserk dirty trick ain't fair to the QB. It's like... He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You gotta punt it here. Come on. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Another bullshit penalty. How long are these guys going to take this? It's not short, but it's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, ho -ho. crowd's loving it. First down and three. Second down and six. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. With moves like that, you know he's got a screw loose. Hey, can we get a handyman out there? Somebody? Drill? Okay, 
Nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. First and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. First and ten. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. Check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Second down and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up third and one. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Two minutes remain in the half. Great! I gotta take a dump! Again? You just wet. How is that even possible? Ah! It's the nachos, man. Want some? And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. They stunt the clock with their first timeout, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. With 
the brain scrambler. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And it's first and ten. Strong run. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the NFL, you moron. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. Well, good heads-up play there, getting it out of bounds. Better than throwing a pick. Well, I want Sean Kicker to make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was Tripod Jenkins, along with the big slot. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? This guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were gonna tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chip wearing a wig. It's a close battle at the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. Third quarter about to begin here, and these guys are locked in a nearly dead heat. I was locked in a dead heat under the covers last night when Bricks started farting like a 4th of July fireworks finale. World, you understand me? team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, man! He just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. First and ten. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. Second down and ten. Now 
there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. First down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and a mile. Second down in a very lot. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Eh, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brains ran with a ball and didn't fall down. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. It's a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and more than the QB would like. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. <laughs> and out comes the most underrated position in football. 
the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog being snagged. He got hit by a car. And he just slipped away like a great pig. Hey, Bricks, you were hit more than a few times like that in your career. 140 times to be exact. In one game, to be more exact. During one play, to be more and more exact. It wasn't even a game, actually. Coach just laid into me on the sidelines. First and two. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the heads off of enemy players. And that'll be second down and four. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. And that'll bring up third and one. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and six. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. First down and six. for two. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. What is this, Andy's wrestling? And it's first and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I gotta, uh... <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Pow! With the brain scrambler!
Third down and eight. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for ten yards. Second down and in inches. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. Well, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. And that is caught for a first down. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And that'll bring up second and one. And it's your mother of a They're going for two points. And they run it in for two points. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten.
You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Third down and three. First down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. Only two minutes left in the game. And that'll be second down and four. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Third down and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. And the rumor is moving crazy fast. Look at the path he's taking. And they just popped his eyes into the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting. Or dead. Or worse. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Ah, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors. And we need money more than they do. like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That yeah, is still edible, though. Just gotta sweep off the charred parts. The offense is looking. The quarterback burns his last time out. He can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. This guy is going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game.
And it's first and ten. It's a six-yard gain. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Man, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And that'll be second down and four. The Sins come away with a sinful win. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. I was it scrambles tomato soup. I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Damn, I know. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...